Hello, my dears, and welcome back to another Let's Build New Crest. And guys, we are on a new lot. I can't believe it. We've finally finished with New Cross Promenade, and we are back in this area. Um, the last build we did here, I think, were the semi detached houses. So the semi detached houses are over this side of the street here. Obviously, we've got the little English looking cottage going on here. <laughs> this series is just going to be the biggest mismatch of um, kind of English and British architecture um, going, yes, going all through it. And today we are here. We're going to be starting on this. Well, how big is this lot? This is 20 by 15. Um, and I've got an idea for these two lots here. What we're going to do, I'm going to build your traditional kind of not old older english home more like 70s 80s english home here on this one and then what i'm going to do on this one is build the same kind of vibe home but in a kind of newer style like they're they're building a lot of eco-friendly houses now in the uk um and they just look a little bit more modern but they've still got the same kind of semi styling so we're going to go, we're going to, we're going to do that. We're going to do that. We're going to start here and build to this one. Um, I have got a reference image for this. I might flash that one up on the screen, actually. I'll flash it just here. We're not going to copy it as it is. Um, we're just going to use that for a bit of inspiration. Um, just so you guys can kind of get an idea of, yeah, houses in the UK. Usually these kind of houses are terraced um, or semi-detached, but... For this one here, obviously, we're going to do it detached because we're a bit limited on lot sizes. So that is where we're going with this one. Um, but yeah, this is going to be cool. I'm looking forward to this. Let's get that grid on. Um, I'm just going to take a point there a minute. We are going to raise this up because this whole street is kind of raised up. Like they've all got a kind of driveway sloping up into a garage. or So we're going to do the same. But this one here is not going to have a garage. We're just going to have a nice driveway instead. Um, and then like a smaller fenced in backyard and whatnot. I think that'd be cute. I think it'd be cute. Anyway, let's get started. We'll keep it on the short uh, uh, wall height as well. I think that'd be cool. Um, I'm going to come out. I'm going to be limited with doors here though. Well, I can put a door in that bit. And I'm going to come here. Lovely. And we're going to go to... Um, yeah, there. That's how wide the house is going to be. I might actually balance it out. Oh, I can't. I can't balance it out. And the drive is going to be here because they're going to need to get up that way. So this does need to go back a little bit. It really does. It really, really does. So this is going to be the living area. Quite a small living room. I'm going to do this. Try and keep it as kind of to scale as I possibly could. So they, they, usually these houses are kind of two up, two down. And what I mean by that is like a two room down the bottom and then two room up. But we're going to try and make this. We're not really. They're not. Some of them are three bedrooms. Um, But for this one here, we're going to try and keep it uh, maybe two bedrooms. We'll do a two bedroom. We'll do a two bedroom. Very, um very much the same kind of shape flowing through there so living area this is going to be the entrance here so we do need to get the uh, stairs in i'm going to flop some stairs in right now uh, we'll just use a generic pair for the minute until we're ready to come into the interiors which we will be doing in the next episode which will be coming out tomorrow my god i don't know what i'm doing um but yes it's coming out tomorrow my friends um i thinking actually just keeping it in a wanna like that so the entrance is going to cut. Yeah, that'll be fine. That will be absolutely spiffingly fine. I hope you're all well. I hope you've all had a nice day. I've had a pretty chilled out day myself. Right, well, how's the toilet there? Oh, yeah, well, how's the toilet there? This is just going to be the kitchen and a small little dining area. Um, but yeah, I've had a pretty generic day. I'm finding myself like... Um... That's a little bit wide, I think. I'm just thinking. So I think it's a little bit wide from the reference image that I've got. Do I want to come in one more there? Can I? I can. It would limit the space though here. But yeah, I've, I've been finding I'm like kind of... Is anybody else like this in their lockdown life? Getting kind of ready means having a bath or a shower 
and then getting into just more comfy clothes. <laughs> that's that's that is how I have, that's how far I've been dressing. I really have. <laughs> it's not exciting at all. Not exciting at all. Uh, I'm going to do it this way, just so I can balance that out. I do think that would be a much better. <sighs> Now I'm looking at it, I kind of want to keep it, keep it wider. We'll keep it wider. We're just going to do it that way. Lovely. Okay. And I am going to do that little like porch thing at the front that it's got to. Okay. So we're going to come across here. Should have kept that. Was that that way? It was, Aiden. The toilet was the right way. And uh, we're going to go across to there. Another toilet up here as well. I don't know where we're going to put that though. Maybe I'll have to come over there. And then maybe I can box that in underneath there. Maybe. Can I have an entrance out that way? Not really, though, because that's where the toilet is. Hmm. Who could say? I mean... Yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. I'm just thinking, have I been to house with that layout before? And I have. My auntie has got a very similar layout to this house here. Um, Okay. Yeah, no, there is going to be enough room here for a toilet because I can just do it there above the other one, which, well, semi above it. Oh, yes, yeah, because I gave myself a little bit more room, didn't I? Huh. Silly bum. Right, the landings are always quite small. And what I mean by landing um, is the kind of like hallway outside the bedroom. Is that just an English thing or do you guys call it a landing? <laughs> I've got a funny story about a landing. Um... Can I say this? Yeah, I can. A friend who should re rename, rename, remain nameless. Um, she's quite well spoken, quite posh. Um, she was seeing this guy once. I think he was called. Oh, I'm gonna make up a name just in case it gets anywhere. Um, Timothy. Uh, she was seeing a guy called Timothy, and we all went round to her house one day. <clears throat> and we spent we ended up staying the night me and a few friends like it was a big party house we were i was about God, 18 and um the my friend who who shall remain nameless well we heard her in the throes of passion with timothy <laughs> yeah she was there she was going to town shall we say and then all of a sudden we heard them kind of like shuffle around and then i i heard my friend shout out um Come along, Timothy. Fuck me on the landing. <laughs> and that, that story has always made me laugh ever since. So, yeah, there's a story about a landing for you. So, you know what a landing is. So, yeah. Friend who is having my nameless wanted to be fucked on the landing. <laughs> I always find that so funny. <laughs> and I'm sure there'll be people out there who find that just as funny as me. Yeah, do you know what? That's not too bad, actually. That is not too bad. I'm going to get a roof on. <laughs> yeah, really fun. Mm, that'd be good merch. Come along, Timothy. Fuck me on the landing. <laughs> <laughs> she would die. She would die. She would die if I, she knew I t told you this, but she also wouldn't care. I know that lady very well. She wouldn't care. She'd find it hilariously funny. <laughs> Do I tuck these in? I think tucking them in would make it look a bit more like it. Yeah, it would. Mm-hmm. And this kind of low profile kind of ceiling as well. Um, and chimney wise, they don't, with these houses, they don't have chimneys on them. They have the kind of vents for the uh, central heating. So the central heating usually like, vent is usually at the top. That's cool. Okay. Okay, my loves. I've got a really, I'm really hoping the window that I've got in mind fits here. Because it would be perfect if it does. That one there. Oh, it's got shutters on it. I suppose it doesn't really matter if I did it all in white. Um, Can I do another one? No. Oh, for God's sake. I hate you when I don't have the cheats on already. There we go. How dare I? I mean, that's not too bad at all, actually. I know it's like cutting into the room there. We're going to sort that layout out now. I'm going to have to. Just so I can house that in. Um, I might have to go from there. And then just tuck it in just a little there. And at least 
the hallway's got a little bit of light even though i will be putting some more windows in here they'd probably have smaller windows onto the side of the house as well so we'll try and keep it as realistic as possible um let's get the roof going on the <laughs> the top here as well i don't know what i'm laughing at i think it's the timothy story it's still in the back of my head <laughs> come along timothy fuck me on the land too <laughs> so that was we, we were just well you can imagine like you know what it would be like with a group of your friends and hearing something as hysterical as that well we were dead we were absolutely dying come along timothy fuck me on the landing <laughs> right tucking that in i think yeah maybe i don't know I, I, i'll see what it's like with a trim We'll see what it's like with a trim. I keep looking at the reference image just so I can get the bearing of it. Yes. To like there. Yeah, I think so. I do believe so, yes. I mean, that would fit perfectly down here as well. I don't know if I want to use the same window down there. Even though they would, really. But I think we're going to go a little bit more... A little bit more creative, shall we say, if we can, with the limited resources in Sims 4. But we're gonna bloody try anyway, my loves. We're gonna be, we're gonna give it a good old bash. Um I mean that would work really well in this one. <clears throat> it's not quite the same vibe as that though, is it? It's not the same vibe. I want the same vibe. That would have been lovely but it's not gonna work um i'm just gonna have a little think actually let me have a little think off of camera okay so we've decided to go for these windows here which are from get to work i just thought they kind of i like the paneling at the bottom i keep checking the reference image i don't know why because it looks nothing like this um but i think that's going to work for this style of build being put around there and a nice door here as well we haven't looked at the doors either needs to be kind of not modern but it can't look traditional really it needs to oh excuse me i nearly burped into the mic then i'm very burpy very burpy i'm a windy pops today <laughs> um yeah it can't look too traditional so i do need it to almost look kind of pvc-esque if you know what i mean this is not the vibe i want i mean that would work here it would Oh, I like the green. The green is winning so far. As is the red. It depends on what swatch we're going to use for the for the um the the wallpapers, though. I mean, it's got a white one there, and it's got a black one. I think the green's the winner for me. Yeah, the green and the white. Yeah, that's yeah. No, I can totally see that. I can. It's right there. <laughs> okay. Right, I'm getting rid of that reference image because it's distracting me. Distracting my very being. I'm not for it. Okay. Um, up the top, we're going to do some kind of... Uh, what do they call them again? Shingles? Or is that disease? <laughs> <laughs> what are they called again? Are they called shingles? Where are you? I never use these because I detest them. But we're going to use it for these. Yeah, shingles. Sounds like a disease. Um, In that tone? Or does it need to be just a little bit lighter? I mean, you could do a colour, but I don't think it's going to match well. That's a much better one. Yes. Yes. Yes and yes. All the yeses that you could ever yes. There we go. Lovely. Oh, I can totally see that. I can't. As I said before, it's right there. Couldn't miss it. Um, and roof tiles. I'd probably stick with these roof tiles, the default ones. But maybe just changing the colour slightly to that. That's better. Is there a better tone for the... Oh, that one. There we go. Oh. Oh, God. That screaming tradi traditional British. I'm just thinking... I might change the window here. I know that they've got the single version of that as well. The question is, does it fit? <gasps> oh, it does. Well, then that's what we're doing, my loves. I'm going to flop that in. That's better. 
Yeah, that's much better. And then I don't have to change the shape to the bedroom then. I can keep the bedroom like that. Oh, that's much better. That's much better. Absolutely stunning. Right, the next bit I want to do is the bottom here. I'm thinking like a like a render, like a creamy coloured render. Um, I don't know if that's the right colour I want. Um, I'm looking over there. There's no reference image whatsoever. I'm on my own for this. I could even do a brick at the bottom, you know. I could even do a traditional brick at the bottom, but maybe keeping the brick to the red tone. Maybe not. No, not that one either. What about some other bricks? Let's have a look at you. What would you look like in a lighter tone at the bottom here, my love? Ooh. Oh, there we go. Yeah, that's perfect. Perfect, perfect. Do we want to do that brick down here as well? Yeah, we do. We definitely do. I'll copy that brick up to there, actually. Oh, there we go. Lovely. Stunning. Stunning. Let's get some roof trims on now as well. Yeah, that's screaming British to me. Absolutely screaming. Ah! <laughs> I have no... No idea what that was. <laughs> I have to excuse me. Oh, my ass is absolutely aching. And not for any dirty reasons, you filthy bastards. It's because I pulled myself a little bit too much in yoga today. I overworked myself and you shouldn't with yoga. You should listen to your body. But I was like, bitch, I want to get this pose in for 20 more seconds. And I just overstretched me ass. <laughs> overstretched me ass. <laughs> um, let's pull this up to this is what height are you yeah around about there yep 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 um i'm gonna hide the foundation so i'm just gonna pick a generic color just so it's blended in if it does come to it i'm gonna be pulling up all of the uh, terrain to that so it doesn't really matter too much okay um and we're gonna put some drain pipes out the front here they're usually in a black or white. I might do them in a black. Um, no, I'm not. I'm going to match them with the windows. I am going to match them in with the windows. So we'll do them. One there. And one there. Lovely. And I usually always see a bloody sky dish on these kind of houses. Like a satellite dish, you know. You know. You know how it goes. Um, I know there is a... Yeah, there we go. So maybe doing this in a, they're usually black as well from my, maybe I could just put it like there and put it over to that jaunty angle. Why does that look weird? That looks strange. Um, Where have you gone? There you are. Maybe I could put it like there instead. Like that. <gasps> oh, oh, that's much better. Yeah, there. I know that might look weird to you, but some a lot of satellites I see stuck on the wall as well. Oh, is that going to be poking through weirdly? Well, there's only one way to find out, sweethearts. And that's if we go in here and put the roof, the things up. Nope, it's not flipping through there. Well, where's that coming into there? Maybe it's just coming into the roof. No, that's fine. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, right. I'm going to start pulling up this terrain. We're going to start pulling up the terrain. To meet. Oh. Oh, hell. Hell spells. Right, if I can do that to theirs, get to you. Oh, not you. You. And people always wonder how I do this. If you hold down the shift key, you can maneuver and make it as kind of big and small as you want. And then if you hold control, look at the circle in the middle. You could then deal with the softness. So you're holding down those keys to kind of, yeah, get that. Just a little pointer for you guys who always seem to wander that. Um, that there is not the right height. There we go. That's better. Uh, it's going to be quite a steep drive, <laughs> isn't it? It's gonna be. I might have to put some stairs here. I can put stairs here, but then maybe smooth this out into a driveway. I need to move this back, but there's not going to be much garden at all. 
And I do need a garden area because they always have a... They usually have quite a substantial size garden, but obviously with this lot, it's not going to... We'll have to do a garden kind of that orientation. Maybe we won't do a drive then. Maybe we'll just keep it as... We'll still do the train like this, but maybe I'll just slope it and put some stairs here instead. Yeah, we'll do that. Um, Stairwise, once again, looking for my reference image. And that house didn't even have stairs, so... <laughs> yeah, I think these stairs would marry well with this house. Oh, definitely. Definitely. I'm feeling it, I am. I am feeling it. Right, we're going to smooth this to like there. I am going to pull this terrain right up around this house right at the front there. Oh my god, I need to bring that all down. You are very excessive, my love. You need to sort your life out. Right, all the way to there. And then we'll smooth all this out. Let me just get a good bit of height going. For the kind of look that I want. Um, I'll, I'll do that to there. And then maybe... Oh, I was going to do stairs from here. Stairs out, but it would probably make more sense if I just did a walled-in garden with a high fence, which is very much seen in the UK. If I can do it to like there. That's a bit of a weird colour. Is it a weird colour or is it the lighting? Maybe just going for that colour. That's better. That's going to sit a lot better. And I'm going to bring the garden out garden out a little bit more here. Just, on, just so we can get a little bit more room. There we go. Yeah, that's perfect. Oh, I'll suit you. Yeah, that's perfect. I am going to pull the train up around here. I don't think it's going to come up around here though. Oh, it does. Oh, then we'll, we'll do that as well. I won't cover that all though. I'll just bring that up. I just make sure I cover the house kind of line up. Let's get a substantial bit of height there as well so I can smooth it out nicely in a sec. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, this is looking more British by the minute. By the minute. And any of you Brits out there, do you live in a house like this? Oh, it looks nice in that lighting. Enjoying the evening lighting. Is that evening? I think it is. Is that evening or is that morning? Oh, it's morning. My mistake. There we go. Oh, I'm hungry. I've just realised how hungry I am. Very hungry. Do I want to bring that all the way up? No. We'll just do... We'll keep it messy like that. Just so it looks like it's earthy. Earthy. Right, and then I'll do the same bit of height here. just so it just, And this just helps me get a better line with the smoothing tool. I'll show you what I mean in a second. This might work well as like a little garden. Like a little flat bit there. Might have to do that. Um, So you've got more to play with now. So I can like just get rid of those pointy nodules that are poking up everywhere. In every orifice. <laughs> I'm sorry. Right, and again here. Look at that nodule. Get down. There we are. Yeah. Yeah, I'm thinking here. Let me get this here. And let me get the grid on. I'm thinking what I may do. Let's get a square. Is flatten this. How much have we got to work with here? Yeah, to there. Can we do the smoothing there? We might be able to. Let's see. Yeah, if I can just do like a two by four. And then get this. Turn the grid off so I can see what I'm doing. Back to circle. Holding shift down. And then let's get the better lighting coming here. Stunning. And then just doing the smoothing of all these nodules at the front here as well. I hope this... the I hope they... Uh, do a better job with the drain tools in 
Sims 5. I really do. Like Planet Zoo train tools in Sims 5. Can you imagine? Someone always, someone keeps saying, why do you always talk about The Sims 5? Because I do. That's why. Because I want it. I'm ready. Um, What did I have in my head then for up here? Uh, These ones here. That, not in that tone. No, that's not the right tone. Neither is that. That one is... Yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes, yes, yes. There we go. Oh, that's lovely. It's very, very, it's very nostalgic, this is, seeing a house like this. Not for any reason. I just like, just reminds me of home. Not my home, because I've never lived in a house like this. Just home <laughs> in general. <laughs> Aiden, shush. Right, railing wise, mm, the, the weird thing is, it would, it would be like a metal pole railing, but we haven't got anything like that. Apart from this, this would work maybe in a seal, just a no. Okay, just a normal generic one as well. And I do know that it's got railings coming down too, so we're going to put them in. In just the silver. Oh, that's great. Yeah. Yeah, they don't want to they don't want to get in their house at all. <sighs> no. Don't be daft. Me get in my house. I don't need to get in my house. Love. Love the uh the railing tool. Love it. Love it. Do you know what I'm gonna do? Oh, I'm not gonna do that. I was go hoping to do this. Oh, is it gonna be weirdly stretched? Oh, oh, I need to go from there. Oh, there we go. So what I did with the fence, it does look a little bit stretched. <laughs> and it doesn't like reach the stair properly. But it's much better than being able to not get in your house, isn't it? So we're going to go with that. And I did that with the fence and the terrain. I've done that quite a lot in a few of my builds. But yeah, there we go. That'll do. That'll do. That'll absolutely do that. Right, I'm gonna start put I'm gonna start placing some windows around the sides of the house now. Um they're usually a little bit more smaller than the ones towards the front and the back of the house. And sometimes not at all, because obviously they're gonna be terraced, so they would have another house there. Um but just for just for these purposes, I'm going to elaborate a little bit. Just so we can get a nice bit of lighting coming through. That's not going to work there because there's a wall there. Um, mm, I don't like that. No, I don't like that. No, I think I'm, what I'm going to do is use these windows down here as well. And just place them like so. Very generically. And not exciting at all. So where was it? One there. Where's the stairs first before I plonk them in? Yeah. There. That's right. And then we've got... It should go there, but it's not going to be able to because of the bathroom. So we won't put it there. We'll do one there, though. Is that a bathroom there? Yep. Perfect. Oh, perfect uh, fit, actually. It's a shame that that can't be a back entrance here just wondering if there was any way I could change the orientation of the bathroom without making a fuck up of the shape too much. Um, let's have a look. What about if I do... Mm, what about if we come out one there? Let's get that... Let's box this in. And what I'm, This is what I'm going to think about doing. I'm thinking about pulling that to there for a start. Pulling you out. Bathroom is now there. This is now an entrance out to the back. Um, and then I can put a roof on top of that. Oh, but then the window's wonky. <sighs> um, 
we can choose we'll choose a different window for down here i just don't like the way that that window sits but i definitely want to do that because it makes the flow of it a lot better okay roof wise anyway i'm going to copy the kind of shape of the roof as what we had at the front um so flaps in there we go yeah lovely lovely yeah yeah that's just made it a little bit more interesting from the side as well let's get those shingles shingles sounds like a disease um and ang was it angled out i think it was i think i used that one no i didn't absolutely not it was this one it was this one there we go lovely okay <clears throat> Just had to check the time then, just in case I'm taking six years doing this. Okay. Right, we need some smaller windows coming in. I'm just going to find the perfect window. Give me one second. And I mean, by no means is it the perfect window, but it reminds me of a PVC window. So I'm going to go with it. I'm not going to put a little extractor, like a little fan on the outside of here as well. This is obviously where the bathroom is housed. And the same up on here too. Maybe I'll put it in the same orientation there yeah yes yes indeedy do okay right what i wanted to do here i wanted an entrance there and i liked the way that it kind of went in um maybe here so the kitchen is i can always open up like the kitchen as well i could even do that now actually so we'll keep the stairs unboxed and what i'll probably do is put a stop there and then open that up there. Maybe I could cut that corner off as well. Maybe. Yeah, I think so. This just gives me a bit more space to play with. Both entrances can be here too. Um, let's try and have a little look. Probably be a, like a sliding glass door, I would imagine, here. So, not the Moschino one, but the... Uh, the base game one i always struggle at finding this door i don't know about anybody else but i struggle at finding the sliding base game door there it is <laughs> that was so hard to find took me ages <laughs> um yep yeah. yep that's working for me and then obviously this is going to be the kitchen so i would want a bit more of a bigger window in the kitchen so i'm thinking about using the this window here on the back here Yes, that would be perfect. Perfect and stunning. In the wise words of Juno Birch. Stunning. Okay. And we'll do the same window at the back here as well. I think that will fit there, won't it? Oh, it will like a dream. Like an absolute dream. And then we'll come and flop on the drain pipe. One there one there and then I'm going to put some drainage in so I'll do a little drain down below oh I'm just going to save my game one second there we go so we'll pop one of these there and we'll do the same here as well it just acts as a little bit of detail a little bit of detail for the drain it wouldn't be white though it definitely won't be white it would be more yeah darker it would be a darker tone a darker tone than that. Um, where are you? There you go. Love. Excuse you. Thank you. And here, I, it would be grass out here. They would have a small patio. In fact, we'll do a small patio. We'll use the same stone as what we've used out here. Just fits really well with this house for some reason. Um, come down to that level. There we go. Little patio area there. And then I'll do some grass here. Oh, stunning. Absolutely stunning. Stunning. It would need an, like an entrance out, but I'm thinking I'm just going to not do an entrance out from this build. Usually you would have a back gate, but um, not today, Sheila. Not today. That's really winding me up that these drain pipes are staying there when I put the roof down. There we go. That one there is still staying there, though, so I need to shuffle it up just an absolute smidgen 
I'm once again 900 feet away from what I'm trying to do. Why do I make things difficult for myself? I think it's because I've always got filming in my head. Like when I, when I watch speedbills and a lot of things are close up and it's all fast, I get dizzy. But um, if it's further away and someone's like trying to do something, I can kind of, I don't know. It's just my way of doing things. Yes, this is definitely, definitely screaming British to me. It really is. Okay, I'm just going to think about what we can do next. I know we want to do a, like a little moment here, but only like a flower bed kind of moment. Nothing too crazy. Um, but yeah, this is definitely looking very British. Okay, let's have a little think. Okay, so I was just hunting around for this little object here. I'm thinking I'm going to put this out the side of the house. And what this is going to be is going to be the kind of gas and electric cupboard, which um, does um, appear on a lot of uh, British houses on the outside. It's usually like sometimes like around here onto the side of it. But we're going to do ours there just for that extra little bit of realism. Lovely. Lovely, lovely. Right, some trees. I'm going to put a couple of trees here. We'll try and stick with the same kind of trees as what we've been using on the other lot. So maybe one of them. We have got those there as well if we wish to. Let's get rid of city living and flop a couple of trees around. That's not the same one. What one is that then? It is that one. Yeah, yes. Yes. I do believe we are going to use this. I do believe so. Yeah, like one there. Lovely. Oh, so I think we'll just do the one, you know. Oh, in fact, maybe I'll do a couple of these. Are they the European ones? I think they are. Yeah, we'll do a couple of these off to the side, but we'll we'll short we'll we'll size them down as well. That took three years to get that out. Then. We'll size them down too. Maybe a big one at the back now. We'll still size it. Right, I'm going to train paint this up a little bit, just to tart it up. Um, I think what we'll do... Here, um, excuse you. There we go. I think what we'll do below the kind of house line, we'll just do a really nice stone, a grey stone. Uh, let's get you down to that. Let's get you down to that, love. All the way along. Lovely, lovely. And I am going to use this on here as well, maybe. Uh, to like I'm going to put a small wall around that maybe an ornament or something ornament we need a couple of bins out here as well a couple of bins which might be weird to some people but bins are quite commonly put out the front of the house in the UK um, the end <laughs> wasn't that a Fucking fascination story from me. Eh? But you were quaking in your seats after that story. Bins at the front of the house. Well, shit the sheets. <laughs> oh, someone alert the church elders. <laughs> oh, Christ almighty God. All right, we'll do this. Um, Someone commented on one of my videos. The other day saying, I think you should do an episode doing an American accent. It's just like, no, I don't want to put you through that because my American accent is hideous. <laughs> I cannot do the American accent any kind of justice at all. <laughs> so no, I will not be putting you through that, I'm afraid. That will not be happening. That will not be happening. Yeah, that's better. That's brought that to life a little bit. Okay, right, and then I'm just going to go onto the earth tone. Oh my god, my game's frozen again. Why do you keep doing that? <gasps> I hope my computer's not breaking. That would be a travesty because there would be no way of me getting it fixed at this time in the world. Yeah, maybe this if we look at that. Eh, no. Maybe the little bit that I put down wasn't too bad, but I think I went a bit... OTT on this side. Just like 
just really just framing in that stone. I don't want it to look like it's just coming out of grass. Yeah, that's a little bit better. That's a little bit better. That is not too shabby at all. And then what I was thinking is using this one, softening it down quite a bit, actually. And just doing a, a load of that around as well. Just ever so slightly, John. Ever so slightly. And I'm thinking here, I'm actually going to go over there with the stone. And put the bins there. Yeah, I'm actually good. In fact, I'm going to do a railing there as well. You know why? Because I can. I'm um, not going to do a mailbox out here because we don't have mailboxes in the UK. We have letterboxes on the actual door. So you may need to put one in if you do download this. Um, or one may appear in the bathroom when you do download it because that's what, that's usually what happens. <laughs> I'm like, oh, hello. <laughs> hello. Okay. Um, and just some generic recycling we'll change the color just so it's it's a little bit different there we go yes yeah that's giving me the vibe i want okay right we'll do a little bit of uh landscaping just underneath here now you would just see more long grass really it wouldn't be any kind of um maybe we can do one of them any kind of flowers or anything Maybe a few daisies. <laughs> I'll pop a few daisies there. Why not? Let's treat ourselves, shall we? There we go. Oopsie daisies. Oopsie daisies. Yep, a couple of daisies. But I don't know what we're going to do, like, wall-wise here. I might actually put that wall in now. But I can't because that's flopped down. I did notice that. Um, Let's flop it back up then, shall we? Up you come, darling. Lovely. And then here, maybe just putting in a... Where's that stone wall? Um, The short one. This one. Is that the right one? I think it is. Oh, God, that's huge. I didn't realise it was that big. Oh, gosh. Oh, no. No, that's not right. No, that's not right. This could work. Yeah, it could work. It really could. Yeah. Yeah, I kind of enjoy that. I'm not going to go around that side because I just want to make it almost look like they could get in there if they wanted to, if you know what I mean. I'll put a few flower boxes out the front here. Um, Let's go into the garden. Into the garden. I'll just put a few of these around here. I may make it accessible. May as well, haven't we? We may as well. We'll make it accessible this way. So maybe I will just take one of them away. And then they can go and plant the stuff at the front of the house there. Yes! Yeah, do you know what? I think this is where we're going to leave it today. We're going to leave it where we've... From what we've built already. I think it looks really cute. I will terrain paint underneath of this as well. Um, but that just, that just scream British traditional kind of 1980s, 70s home to me. I think it's very cute, actually. <laughs> if I do say so myself. Um, <laughs> but yeah, I'm going to be back tomorrow. We're going to be finishing up this one. Maybe this will go on for another one or two. I probably say it's going to go on for another two episodes. But yeah, tomorrow we'll make a start on the back garden and we'll finish up the rest of the exterior. Just adding a few more details here and there as to where we can. Maybe a few more trees and stuff and whatnot. Um, and then we'll start going into the interiors and stuff and making it look a little bit more shabby. Not like, just like it's been lived in for years, you know? Like a family of, you, like the family of grown up in it, grown up in, in the house and gone and the parents are still living there and they haven't de redecorated or something along the, that for a storyline which will help me in making the family uh maybe in the third episode we can go and make the family and make their stories and whatnot that could be quite fun as well but anyway my loves i will see you all tomorrow thank you for watching this video once again 
um, leave me a comment down below as always I will try and answer and read as many as I possibly can and I will see you tomorrow goodbye